The Hader Ali of Foundation presents A Living History Azerbaijan is known for its rich and ancient culture, featured by numerous surviving historic and architectural landmarks, as well as written artifacts. Protection of this invaluable legacy, as well as its preservation for the generations to come, and promotion all over the world, were the major goals of Haider Ali, the great national leader of Azerbaijan. This noble mission is nowadays followed by Mr. Ilham Ali, the president of Azerbaijan, known for its sensitive attitude to the precious historic heritage and significant input into the preservation and promotion of tangible legacy. Cooperation with UNESCO is therefore of a special significance for Azerbaijan because as time passes by, the monuments reflecting human imagination and creativity gain a particular value by ceasing to be a property of just a single nation and becoming a true asset of the humankind. The historic and cultural heritage of Azerbaijan has always been of a high interest for UNESCO. During his visit to the country in 2005, Mr. Matsura, the Director General of UNESCO, attended a number of these cultural and architectural sites together with Mrs. Mehriban Aliyeva, UNESCO's Goodwill Ambassador. Efforts are currently made to include two of these cultural sites, such as the Gabastan National Preserve and the Shervanshaft Palace, into the list of UNESCO protected monuments. Shortly prior to this memorable visit, a set of medieval Azeri medical manuscripts were included into the register of UNESCO's Memory of the World program, which provides a depository for unique written works of global significance. History of medicine has deep roots in Azerbaijan. More than 4,000 high-grade crops and plants endemic for the country's diverse climatic conditions have been cultivated for centuries with the majority of them known for their medicinal effect. Rich natural resources and wildlife of Azerbaijan had been used for medical purposes since the times immemorial. Some species of the country's wildlife are typical for both Europe and Asia. With its beneficial geographical location, diverse climate and abundant resources, Territory of Azerbaijan has been known for being one of the ancient hopes for human settlement, written culture and science, including medicine. Primeval inhabitants of the area were aware of curative effects of various plants and practiced primitive methods of healing. Azerbaijan, also known as the Land of Fire, had been a hotbed for the Zoroastrian religion up until dissemination of Islam. Avesta, the holy book of fire worshippers, contains profound information related to medicine. A real renaissance of medical studies in Azerbaijan occurred after the 9th century, with numerous medical centers, clinics, and pharmacists thriving all over the area for the five next centuries. Malham Medical Center, established by Kafia Dinamar in Shamahi in the 12th century, followed by Darush Shafa Medical University, founded in Tabriz in the 14th century, are just a few to mention. A number of valuable medical works have been written by the medieval Azeri scholars. Some of these unique manuscripts are cherished up to date at various institutions, including the Manuscript Institute at the National Academy of Sciences of the Republic of Azerbaijan. 364 out of 11,000 late medieval manuscripts preserved at the archives of the Manuscripts Institute are directly related to medicine. Three out of them were included into the register of UNESCO's Memory of the World program due to their tremendous scientific significance. One of these particular precious manuscripts entitled The Surgery and Tools Thereof by Abul Qasim al-Zahrawi, an 11th century scholar, is a final part of a large multi-volume edition known as Al-Maqalat al-Thalathin, the 13th treatise. The work provides dozens of figures of various surgery tools and the ways of their application. Abul Ghassim was also known as Abul Qais in the European scholarly circles with the Latin version of his work used as a textbook at multiple European universities. 
Another manuscript cherished in Baku is Al Qanun Fitti, The Laws of Medicine by Abu Ali ibn Sina. Rewritten in Baghdad back in 1124, it is considered one of the most unique works by this scholar. The work provides narratives on simple medicines with no additives and describes several hundreds of homeopathic mineral and animal pharmaceuticals. Prior to writing the original text of the work in Hamadan, Ibn Sina made a series of trips to Azerbaijan. Zahirei Nizam Shah, Nizam Shah's Asses by Rustam Gurjani, written in the 13th century, with a front page rewritten in the 18th century, has been only discovered in the Manuscript Institute of Baku so far. The work is of an encyclopedic value and it encompasses nearly all aspects of medicine and pharmacology. The print is just fascinating with colorful ornaments and golden watercolor decorations. All the works mentioned above are currently included into the register of the UNESCO's Memory of the World program due to their global value and significance. Meanwhile, these are just a small part of cultural legacy of Azerbaijan, a country known for its substantial input into the world treasury of tangible and intangible heritage. The riches and assets of this ancient land are still to be studied and researched. <laughs>